Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. In this video, we'll see the answers for NPTEL IoT course week 7 assignment 7. The due date for this assignment is March 15, 2023. So let's get into the answers. First question is, the switches in a non-software defined network environment do not have a global view of the network, true or false? The answer to this is A, true. Uh, the switches forward the traffic in a distributed manner. The second question is, which of the following is not a function of the application plane in software-defined network architecture? So options are business logic implementation, B, security, C, traffic engineering, and D is forwarding. So the right answer is they are asking, which is not a function of the application plane in software-defined network architecture? So here, D, forwarding is the right answer security, routing, traffic engineering, and other applications. They are the functions of the application plane in software-defined network architecture. So control plane takes care of the functionality of network OS and the data plane takes care of the task of forwarding. Next, in socket programming, the parameter AF underscore INET stands for. The options are Unix protocols, internet protocol, file sharing, and time slicing. AF underscore Unix is used for Unix internal socket protocol and AF underscore INET stands for internet protocol. So the right answer to this is B, option B. Next question number four, during, during remote server access by a Raspberry Pi, where the Raspberry Pi acts as a client, the client needs the following. Only IP address of server, only port number, both server IP address and port number, client's IP address. The right answer to this is option C, both server IP address and port number. Question number five, controllers in SDN receive requests from the repeaters, gateways, switches, and routers. The right answer to this is switches. Next question is, during remote server access using socket programming, what is the utility of the socket name dot listen function? So right answer to this is to wait for the clients to connect. Listen function is used for by the server to wait for the clients to connect. So this is used to, the binding to the port is actually done by the bind function. Next one is question number seven. With respect to client server model of socket programming, in which of the following does the function socket name dot bind reside? So the answer to this is B server. So bind function should be called on the server side to bind the server socket to the network, to a specific network interface. The next one is, which among the following are valid data processing activities? Data splitting, data filtering, data plotting, and all of the given. The right answer to this is all of the given. Data splitting, data filtering, and data plotting. They are all valid data processing activities. Question number nine is, which among the following is the correct direction for the packet underscore in type messages in SDN? So the right answer is, from switch to the controller. Switch sends a packet in message to the controller and the controller will decide a flow rule. Next question is, suppose a particular flow rule has a soft timeout of five seconds and a hard timeout of three seconds. Is this association correct? A, yes, and B is no. The right answer is option A, yes. In SDN backup controller, in SDN backup controllers are required for which among the following? To act as backup of the main controller all the time, to act as backup when the main controller fails, to replace the main controller altogether and none of the stated. The right answer to this is option B, to act as backup when the main controller fails. So if the primary controller is down, then the backup controller takes over. Next question number 12, which of the following is true? In traditional network, we have routing table. In software defined network, we have routing table. Or option B, traditional network, we have flow table. Option uh, software defined network, we have routing table. Option C, traditional network, we have routing table. And software defined network, we have flow table. 
So the right answer to this is option C. So in a traditional network, we have the routing table and we have the flow table in an SDN, that is software defined network. So the right answer is option C. 13th question, what are the benefits of using SDN over IAT? So the right answer is, so management of device heterogeneity, management of end device mobility and dynamic flow rules, software control of end devices, that is sensors and actuators, all of the given. The right answer is option D, all of the given. Next, we have sensor open flow, soft WSN and SDN wise are examples of. So answer is option C, various implementations of the concept of software defined IoT. Sensor open flow, soft WSN and SDN wise are various implementations of software defined IoT. Question number 15. Consider the Python script using the split function. What will be the correct print output? So data is equal to apple comma gova hash banana. Variable is equal to data dot split of hash and print of variable. So here the right answer is here we are splitting based on hash. So you'll have uh, apple comma gova as one element and banana as another element after splitting. So the right answer is option D, apple, comma, goa, and banana. That's all with the answers.